Quotes from, Francis de Sales from the Kindle, Deep Christian Quotes and Bible Verses. First quote. In like manner many people dress up in exterior, with the visible acts expressive of earnest devotion, and the world supposes them to be really devout and spiritual-minded, while all the time they are mere lay figures, mere phantasms of devotion. Second quote. Well-meaning people, who have not as yet attained a true devotion, attempt a manner of flight by means of their good actions, but rarely, slowly and heavily, while really devout men rise up to God frequently, and with a swift and soaring wing. Third quote. In short, devotion is simply a spiritual activity and liveliness, by means of which divine love works in us, and causes us to work briskly and lovingly. And just as charity leads us to a general practice of all God's commandments, so devotion leads us to practice them readily and diligently. And therefore we cannot call him, who neglects to observe all God's commandments either good or devout, because, in order to be good, a man must be filled with love, and to be devout, he must further be very ready and apt, to perform the deeds of love. Fourth quote. We are crucified to the world, and the world must be as crucified to us. It esteems us as fools, let us esteem it as mad. Fifth quote. And for as much as devotion consists in a high degree of real love, it not only makes us ready, active, and diligent in following all God's commands, but it also excites us to be ready and loving, in performing as many good works as possible, even such as are not enjoined upon us, but are only matters of counsel or inspiration. Even as a man just recovering from illness, walks only so far as he is obliged to go, with a slow and weary step, so the converted sinner journeys along, as far as God commands him, but slowly and wearily, until he attains a true spirit of devotion. And then, like a sound man, he not only gets along, but he runs and leaps in the way of God's commands, and hastens gladly along the paths of heavenly counsels and inspirations. Sixth quote. Faith fills a man with love for the beauty of its truth, with faith, in the truth of its beauty. Seventh quote. Cultivate a special devotion to God's word, whether studied privately or in public, always listen to it with attention and reverence, strive to profit by it, and do not let it fall to the ground, but receive it within your heart as a precious bomb, thereby imitating the blessed virgin, who kept all these sayings in her heart. Thanks.